Hello, we are Merku Machining and we produce cube sugar machines. In this video we will show you the innovations of the drum type automatic cube sugar machine line. The cube sugar production process starts with the pressing unit. At the minimum contact points of the mixer and the mold all the aids are made of a special bronze. This bronze consists of an aluminium nickel bronze alloy. Here, all sides can be fine toned so that the gap is minimal. Thus, the small granulated sugar crystals in the mixer don't come out of the contact points and there is no product wastage. The alloy of this piece is special. It consists of aluminium nickel bronze. This alloy is made on order and is in accordance with the standards of the food industry. Also, on the press wall there is a bronze, the same aluminium nickel bronze alloy. Brinell's density is 32, that it means it's a hard bronze. We strengthen the holders of the press wall with adjustments. Also, here we put stainless steel or a special metal, not aluminium. In addition, we ensure that the contact between the pneumatic shaft and the cylinder is at three points. This increases the service life of the pneumatic mechanism. This system has proven itself, has been working flawlessly on our machines for over five years. Also, the roller has an inner spring, which makes the operation of the pressing wall smoother. And what's the plus? All these parts are made of stainless steel, those reinforcing the entire mechanism. We have a weight lack at two points. We also made a system where the eccentric guides that wear out over time can be replaced. The part that wears out is removable and it's made of stainless hardened steel. Once worn, two years or more depending on the work cloud, this system is replaced very quickly, thus extending the overall life of the mold. This greatly simplifies the operation of the machine. When we are sending the drum type automatic cube sugar machine line to the customer, we always give a crusher with it. This crusher can also be called a sugar crystal grinder. Now I will explain you the benefit of this crusher in details. There are many factories for the production of granulated sugar in the world. Granulated sugar is produced from sugar beet or sugar cane. Therefore, different countries have their own technologies. Even in the same country, in the same factory, granulated sugar is produced with different crystal ratios. Therefore, you can use different granulated sugar in the production process. We make the crystals smaller with the crushers so that the cubes produced are the same. The crusher have sieves in of different size that can be changed. By the way, if it is necessary, it should be specified that granulated sugar can be transferred directly to the mixer without operating the crusher. For example, you board the granulated sugar with smaller crystals as a raw material. Then you don't need to grind it. Here is the regulator with which you can turn off the crusher. When you turn off the crusher with this regulator, the sugar will pass directly to the helizon and is transferred to the upper bunker. What are the advantages of this crusher? The drum type machine presses a large number of sugar cubes at a time. Now I'm going to show you the mold. For example, the capacity of this machine is 25 tons. In the mold, there are many cubes in a single row. If you have a large crystals to get a cube with an ideal cube shape and even corners, you will need to increase the load of the press wall. Also, the pressure on the rollers or roll balls will be greater. The higher ratio of the small crystals in the granulated sugar, the better the cubes are formed, the less the load on the rollers and the press wall. 
wall. Naturally, this means that the service life of the machine is increased. Also, the higher the proportion of small crystals in the granulated sugar, the more ideal the shape of the cube produced. In addition, it should be noted that the, such a cube will crumble less during transpiration and will return its appearance positively, affecting the choice of the last customer. In summary, by using sieves of different size, you can adjust the quality of the cube produced and ensure less wear on the equipment as less pressure will be exerted on the pressing wall. And now we are going to show you the cubes. These cubes are made by a granulated sugar from Turkey. This is a bead sugar. We pass the sugar through the crusher. The shape and corners of the ideal looking cube as you can see, and the density is the same throat, and we would like to show you the granulated sugars with different crystal ratios. This is a granulated sugar produced in Turkey from sugar beet as European standards. Do you see this bee crystal? This is a granulated sugar produced from sugar cane in Brazil. The crystals of the sample are even larger. This is a granulated sugar produced from sugar cane in Pakistan. If you don't pass these granulated sugars through the crusher, the best cube is made from steel granulated sugar. And then, this is one. The worst looking cubes will be those made of this granulated sugar. Their density will not be the same. Their corners will not be even. They will certainly crumble during transpiration. For these reasons, we strongly recommend using a crusher. In addition, we place magnets in the upper bunker. Those we prevent all foreign metal objects that may have entombed the granulated sugar for any reason from entering the press system and breaking the more these magnets capture even small metal particles and prevent them from entering the final product. Our new type of oven makes it possible to produce sugar cubes in smaller facilities. When a press is started, the steel band runs automatically. The ovens are automatically closed. The headers are turned on also automatically and the whole system starts to work. Since the type of ovens heat up very quickly and reach the same temperature, when the press and band stop, the heaters of the ovens are automatically turned off and the pneumatic system opens all the oven. This is not only prevents the burning of cubes on the band, but also provides significant energy conservation. The furnace system works in parallel with the cooling system. In order work, when the bell starts to run, not only the ovens but also the collars are turned on. When the band is closed, the collars are also turned off and energy is saved. The centering system of the stainless steel belt allows you to increase the life of the belt after 10 years. The stainless steel band washing and cleaning system help us clean up sticking sugar crystals in countries with high humidity. High humidity causes sticky sugar slurry to build up in the tape, causing other sugar cubes produced over time to stick to the band and deteriorate its appearance. This creates problems in the operation of the packing robot. For this reason, we establish a band washing and cleaning system to prevent such problems and ensure the entire line operates smoothly. And here is the bag's making machine. The system of placing the bag directly down and on the conveyor in a centered manner is very helpful in small boxes. Those, these box fall directly onto the conveyor without typing cover. This is the biggest advantage of this new system. The box making system is a cube with sensors that stop the system if there are enough boxes on the conveyor. While the main engine and vacuum operators are turned off on the glue heaters in the container continue to operate. All these help to achieve significant energy savings. 
And so we move on to the packing system. Let's explain you the innovations in this system right now. The main advantages of our machine is that the robot heats move in their own trajectory to enter and exist the box. In addition, the separation of the heats is done mechanically. As in the pneumatic system, the heat don't twitch and the sugar cubes don't fall. All this significantly increases the packaging speed while the loss of cubes during packaging is reduced to zero. The sugar cube production process ends in the box closing machine. Our machine supply glue intermittently with a special mechanical method during the gluing of boxes. This reduces of amount of glue used. These are the innovations we wanted to talk about. Keep following our channel to be informed more about the innovations in our machines.